ETFinalScore.com has East Texas high school sports covered. And now you can take it with you. Get the latest scores from Friday Night Football, articles and videos. Focus in on Dotney photo galleries and more. So don't miss a thing and get your ETFinalScore.com app today. Hi, this is Dana Huey with your CBS 19.TV web exclusive for Tuesday, September 24th. Move over Burger Wars. It's now time for French fries to face off. Today, Burger King is launching new low-calorie French fries. The fast food chain says its new Satis fries have 40% less fat than market leader McDonald's and 30% fewer calories. The low-cal, low-fat fries at Burger King will cost 20 to 30 cents more per serving, except in kids' meals where there will be no price difference. Disney theme parks are putting an end to a policy that allowed disabled visitors to get instant access to rides instead of waiting in line. There were widespread reports that able-bodied people were reportedly abusing Disney's disability policy. Disney says the new policy won't allow immediate access to rides. Starting October 9th, guests with a new disability access card will be issued a ticket with a time to enter an attraction based on the current wait time so they don't have to stand in line. Toys R Us will hire 45,000 workers this holiday season, the same as last year. Walmart is increasing its seasonal workforce by 10 percent when it hires 55,000 workers. And say goodbye to a symbol of the 60s, counterculture movement. The last Volkswagen van will roll off the assembly line at the end of the year after 63 years of production. Brazil is the last place that produces that van. Production is stopping because the van no longer meets safety requirements. And that is your Consumer Corner for this Tuesday. I'm Dana Huey.